What's up guys, Shane Starnes here with Droid Modder X. Today I'm gonna to show you guys how to speed up the Honor 5X. So as you guys noticed in the OnePlus X versus Honor 5X speed test, the Honor 5X, after it loads several applications, begins to lag quite a bit. It even has trouble loading up applications. So the Facebook load time was about 20 seconds. I'm gonna show you guys how to fix this lag on the Honor 5X to give you a snappy, fluid experience on this incredible budget phone. Let's go ahead and get started. All right guys, so there are a few things that contribute to the slowness or lagginess of the Honor 5X, and a few of those things are enabled by default. I have no reason or no clue why they would be enabled by default, but they're very easy to change. So there is a battery performance setting that we can just turn off completely. That helps. We'll go to power savings. Now I know that these settings were made in order to save on battery life and to make your battery last longer. And the Honor 5X has incredible battery life, but it doesn't really need all these intense uh, measures to save that battery. So what you can actually do is turn on normal mode. So it's set at smart mode by default. So when you first power up the phone, that's where it'll be. And you see that even in their estimate, you only get about an hour of battery life savings. All right, so another thing that can really slow down the performance of this phone is the protected apps. So what's kind of strange is that it only allows applications that you have checkmarked as protected to continue to run in the background. This is supposed to save battery life, but when you're multitasking, that can really slow things down to the point where the phone actually has to totally recall applications from scratch. Uh, what you can do in here is any applications that you use on a regular basis, go ahead and turn them on. So if you normally use Facebook, if you normally use, uh, say, Twitter, um, basically any and all applications that you would normally use, go ahead and turn them on here. Okay, so instantly you'll notice a difference when multitasking. So if I load Facebook, it's gonna take a while to load at first. Okay, but when I go back to the home screen and then back to Facebook, it's there and ready to go. So in my speed test, you notice that it had to recall Facebook from scratch. It didn't just pick up where it left off. That's because it wasn't checkmarked under the protected apps mode. Okay, so here is Crossy Road. We'll turn that on. And that means that anytime I open up Crossy Road, it's not gonna have to recall that application. Once it's loaded that application, I'll always be able to go back to it, which really speeds up multitasking. Okay, so now it's been loaded once. There's no reason to load it extra times. It's there and it's ready to go. Lastly, installing a third-party custom launcher like the Google Now launcher is really gonna speed things up. For some reason, EMUI tends to bog down this particular device. Uh, so we'll go ahead and open the launcher and we'll set it for always. Okay, so now we are running the Google Now launcher. As you can see, scrolling through screens is super fast with zero to no lag. You even have an app drawer, which is a nice addition here. And as you can see, the app drawer is super snappy. Notification drawer pulls down super quick. Adding a custom launcher to the Honor 5X can really do wonders, along with those other settings that I told you guys about with the battery performance mode being at normal and setting all of your applications up as protected applications. Anyways, guys, that about wraps it up for this video. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmoderx.com. Follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx. Thanks, guys, for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.